to stay out in front of you. Bring those hands behind you, nice wide out of the body, a little bit of rotation in that upper spine. And then lift your knees up, those legs from right to left, warming up the spine. Seated leg twist. Starting with your knees bent, just, just gonna let your knees fall over to the right. Let those knees touch the floor. Knees to point up towards the ceiling, then exhale. Let those knees fall, to some nice rotation into the spine. Opening through, seated leg twist. Starting with those arms behind you, fingers point to that left shoulder. Get some rotation into the upper part of the spine. Spine. Inhale, coming back to center, and exhale. Let your eyes guide the movement. At the same time, cross right, cross left, pause, other way, right? Come to the left of your space. Start with your feet wider than hip distance apart. Reach left in front, left behind. Right in front, right behind. High three for the, let's go. Left, right, and again, right. wider than hip distance apart. Get into that semi-squat, nice long spine. Give yourself a hug, fingertips onto the shoulders, and you're rotating the upper spine. Maintaining that stabilization in the lower body. Create some heat in that core. Hold your belly in. Keep breathing. Push those arms out in front. Draw the elbows in. Here's the movement. You're going to push the arms forward, swing them back, up and around, and then pull the arms back down. Now we go the opposite direction. Push, swing, pull. Push, swing, that semi-squat. Russian arms. You keep, keep twisting that upper body. Keep the belly. Keep breathing. You're doing great. Into those single legs in front. Two fists. Here's the action. Push, swing, pull. Breathe. So clasp those hands and rotate that upper body. Find your move. You're doing great. Just keep moving your body. On that left leg. Get that right leg up to 90 degrees. Find your arms. Here. Push, swing, pull. Make it dynamic. As you start to tilt forward with the left to right, maintaining that nice leg. To come out, come back to neutral. Place that right one leg. As you start to tilt forward, lift that back leg up to 60 degrees. As they are as we start that pendulum movement. So start to move the arms with the part. Stabilize through that left leg by push and change sides. This is mod three for the single leg to 90 degrees. Your arms are straight down, controlling the movement. Left, take a breath, keep the hip distance apart. Bend into those knees about 30 degrees. Keeping the lower body stable, you're gonna zen swing the upper body. So bring the left arm and the right arm in front and back of the body. Let the upper body rotate as the lower body stays stable. Find your breath. 60 degrees, and then find that zen swing. So right arm in front, left arm behind, and now start rotating around the axis of the spine. Just letting the body move, keeping the lower body nice and stable. Find your breath. Feel that rotation all the way up through to the cervical spine. Hips back, weight into the heels, knees bent. Reach the left arm in front, right arm behind, and now start your zen swings. So stabilizing through the lower body, as you move the upper body. Wider than hip distance apart. Really get into those legs, stabilize the lower body. Tuck those elbows in, we're gonna do little jabs. Really use your breath here. A little bend into the elbow, strong arms, strong core. Distance apart, really get into that lower body. Secure the core, belly button pulled in, get those boxing gloves up, and let's go, punch it in. Right into the bread basket. Use your breath. Lower body. Make push into those feet. Anchor down. Plug that belly and get those boxing gloves up. And let's punch it out. Full extension here. Lots of strength into those arms. You're serious. You're going for it. Into that squat position. Bend into those knees about 50 degrees. As you jump, swing those arms up. Land safely. And then step to do the opposite way. Bend into those knees. Get those arms back. Jump. Reach the arms up. Land knees softly. 70 degrees. Get low. Now swing those arms up as you push off the balls of your feet. Let's go. Land softly and go the other direction. Bring those arms down, get low, bring those arms back, push up, land safe. By the side, action comes from the feet, reaches through the fingertips, get low, get that butt back and jump it. Soft landing and switch sides. Going back the other direction, bring those arms down, get low, bring those arms back, push up, squat. Start with those feet wide apart, toes, and we're gonna find a little pulse. You're surfing. This is mod two for the surfer's squat. Start with those feet and your surfer. Just little pulses up and down. Keep that belly button. Scenery, oh yeah. 90 degree bend into those hips. We're pulsing. You're on your board. You're feeling the wave pulled in. See those waves. So, like a T and start with both legs extended. And are you gonna lift your right with the toe and then come back up through neutral, inhale, exhale, change. We're just reaching about 45 degrees from that other leg. Finding this nice rotation to the spine, warming up both the legs. Starting to pick that right leg up, Think up to center, big inhale, relax that leg onto the floor and change sides, lift to the floor. Come back to neutral and change. Continue the spine. And leg crossovers. Come to lie on your back. Reach your arms out like, so get that 90 degree bend and then reach, reach, reach. Get up, 
and cross over. And exhale, trying to get that toe right in front of that left, continuing here, moving from side to side. We're gonna do supine scissor kicks into some prone to the ceiling, a micro bend into the knees, arms, toes here. Draw your belly button in so you're using your core. Find those deep abdominal muscles. Keep moving your legs, you're doing great. So come to lie on your belly, Egyptian arms, forehead to the floor, toe opposite legs, as quickly as you can. Breathing, move your body. You're doing, you're gonna do some surfing. Your trainer's gonna give you a different command. You're gonna go under the wire, you're on the bump on that board. Get up, right leg, hop onto that board. Start in that pike position. You're gonna go under the wire, you're on the board. And now that feels good. And now you're gonna jump up, left leg leads, and position with your legs. Get low on the board, and you're swimming. You're gonna jump, one leg and get up with that right leg, and eight position. Get low, up high, and you're on the board. Stepping with the left leg, and mountain climbing. All the moves, and practice good form, sweat, and have some fun. On all fours, get ready. Right hand forward, you a rock, you're gonna go for it. We're gonna go to the right side of the mound. Stay low, get it. And you're gonna go forward again. Look at the sky. We're gonna flip back over, and forward. Oh, you gotta go back, you found the ledge back there. Finish it off, go to that crawl. A little micro bend into the knees about 15 degrees. Give yourself a hug. Come back to center, place the heels down. Lift up the heels, pivot on the... This is mod two for the hip twister. Starting with your feet just wider than hip to Russian arms and move from the hips. So bring those hips to the left. Three for the hip twister. Starting with those feet wider than hip distance apart. Head. Now we're gonna lift up onto the balls of the feet and turn our hips to the left. Right, center. For the rundown. Come to the back of your space. Get those knees up, we're gonna do fast. Walk out, get those knees bent, reach that right arm forward, and then knees, left hand reaches forward, and then walk all the way back. Keep knees. We're gonna do core walk out and we're gonna practice reaching those opposite arms in and then walk all the way back. Get up there, high knees, come all the way back. Get going, you're doing great. Those arms, be happy that you're moving, land on those toes, do it again, reach with the other side. High knees, as high as you can, bump those arms. Get those knees up. For the throwing lunge. Starting with your feet in a neutral position, up and over, follow through and step back. And now change legs, step. 30 degree bend into those knees. This is my two for the throwing lunge. We're gonna step forward with that other side. Right foot comes forward, left arm up and over. 60 degrees. Starting with our feet in neutral position. Take a big step forward with that left hand. Step forward, arm comes down, step back. Ops. The traveling push up. Let's set up in that plank position. Feet left hand, push up, come straight back up. Back through center. Left hand, right hand, push up. Back through center, right? Lean push up. Start in that push up position. Hands just wider than shape foot. Left foot, left hand. Push up. Now back through. Push up. Back to center, right? Left position. We're gonna do some plyo push up. So as you land, you're gonna land there with the body. So it's gonna look like this. You're bending the elbows, now you're gonna to the left. And back. Other. The V drill. Start in the back of your space. We're gonna take steps back. One, two, three. Light on the feet, quick movement. Ten, keep moving those arms for the V drill. Starting at the back of your space. We're gonna move three quick steps to the right. Go, one, two, three. Back through, think. All the way back, all the way to the left. V drill, starting at the back of your space. We're making a V shape, three quick. Get that heart rate up, get those feet moving. We're moving from side to side. Keep moving, light on those toes. Get up, come to lie on your back. In a tray of fruit with that right hand. Your left eyes on that right hand the entire time. So we're gonna practice to get up. And then try to keep that hand up as you come to land. Use your core, lift up, and then come all the way back down. Doors, I flex the hand, right arm out at 45. Push into that left, go again. Exhale on exertion. Straight right knee bent. We're gonna do both sides. Reach right hand the entire time. We're gonna push into the right foot and come up onto that. Lie back down onto the floor, keeping your eyes on that right hand. Let's try other's head. Other side, bend the left knee, straighten the right, right palm into the floor. To get up, push into that left foot, Push, then the lower back, then the shoulders, then the head. Let's try again. Come to lie on your back. We're gonna start with flexion, left arm out. Boat here, you're gonna push into your right foot, come into a bit of a side. So your hips are facing the back, and then push up and onto the floor. Windshield wiper that left foot in, breathe it again. Push up, keep your eye on that right hand. Windshield wiper, hand down, scoot through. Right arm out at 45. Push onto that right hand, hand down, you're gonna bring that distance right apart. Look down at your toes. Pick them up and then swivel arms face up to the ceiling. From here, drop your left hand on the inside of that left leg. Moving down for a count of three. One, two, one, two, three. 
and then lifting all the way back same, into that side body. Keep everything nice and strong. Pick up your toes and turn your toes out at 45 degrees. From here, drop your left hand on the inside of that left leg, looking up at the inside of that left leg for three. Lower down, one, two, up to that starting position, and go again. Lower down, right back up. Keep moving with your breath. Lower down, working that right side of the body. Your feet wider than hip distance apart. Lift up those toes, step to the ceiling. Drop your left hand on the inside of your left one, two, three, really feeling three, and coming all the way. Fingers of the right hand. Lower down. One for the wrestling shuffle. Starting at the back of your space position. We're gonna move, shuffling, three steps to the right. One, two, two, one, two. Switch directions, left leg leaps. One, two, one, two, two for the wrestling shuffle. Starting at the back of your space. Come on, we're gonna shuffle to the right three times, come back and shuffle leading with the left leg, two, three. Switch legs. One, two, three. One, two, three. Base. Athletic stance. Right foot forward, slightly arms out. We're gonna move. Teams. One, two, three. Stay low. Sneak up on them. We're gonna do Zen swings into downward dog and upward dog. Zen swings. Let the hips move with the body. Breathe into the whole body. Ribs almost touching the thighs. Transfer your weight forward into that table with the elbows bent. Bring the forehead back down. Curl the toes under. Come back. Bend the elbows. Chest to floor. Release the toes. Lift the chest. Come forward. Release the knees, fill the toes, push back up, downward dog. Zen swings into downward dog, upward dog. Let's start with, let's loosen up the whole upper body. Let the energy, coming down, come forward back into that plank position. Lowering, to come back to plank, lift the hips up and back, downward dog. Keep the upward dog, 10 toenails on the floor. Curls are bent. Use your core, lower the chest towards the floor. The knees, downward dog. Keep moving with your trainer's command. Variations, just follow along, do the best you can. We're gonna do Zen swings and start that arm movement. Add the feet. So you're moving shoulders, getting that Zen and coming in for those downward dogs into upward dog. Lift your hips up and back for downward facing dog. A little hover there. Slide onto the top to the come back into downward facing dog. Squeeze into the ribs. Lift the chest, back of the neck long. Squeeze. Keep moving. Have fun. Breathe.